What's good? Welcome to Don't Flop. This is Training Day's Fiddler's Elbow. Last time of the main events of the day. Please make some noise! <laughs> Shouts to this motherfucker in the building all the way from Philly, man. What's up? Damn, nigga. <laughs> Shouts to Bam on his birthday, big up Josiah, big up everyone in the spot, man. Shouts to all the fans giving up that weekend. This is another free event we did to bring us some new people through, some vets through. We've got a lot of shit going on. All right, this is one of those battles where one of the guys is a vet and one of the people is a, a newbie. So I'm going to let the MC on my right-hand side introduce herself. Let them know you are. Yo, live winter. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> As the guy on the left is a vet, I'm gonna introduce him. He absolutely annihilated his last battle here in the December. King. Please make some noise for Pedro. Hey, wait. Hey, big up Royalty made in London for the jump, really. He hates the school, and he hates cool, It's round number one, I'm gonna do Pedro. Let's go, man. <laughs> Hello. All right. <laughs> she moved away. I'll bruise her face. <laughs> We need to lose some weight. I'll be moving flake on the side of the road. Get a knife to your throat, all my rhyming is dope. Yo, yeah. listen, yeah? Live winter, you're a lip singer. I finger your ass with my big finger. And you ain't a fit ginger, you're a shit minger. I throw your fucking mum in a pig mincer. Yo, 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 you look like Amy Winehouse. Yo, you look like Amy Winehouse before she died out. You can't even make the try Now you got brown trainers. Everything I spit is mouth breakers, ground breakers. I'm ounce takers, house raiders. Yo 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 yo, you're a nervous lipstick. Yo, you got purple lipstick. I'm going to fit chick. What's she gonna say? She's a dirty big pig. Yo, this? you got a tattooed chest that stabs straight through your stab proof vest. Yo, I fucking attack you. Yes, you wanna have black. Group sex. <laughs> oh, yo, 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 yo. Oh, yo, yo, yo. When your mum was pregnant, she drank Guinness. I don't care if I come with dumb lyrics. I'm gonna finish it now because it's one minute. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Hold it down, it's gonna live. Round number one, let's go, man. Yo, when I got this, uh, message me, like, don't fuck this up. Because yeah. this could be an opportunity for you to, like, move higher up. So I thought, fuck. I mean, maybe I am out of my league. I should do some research and treat this battle with the respect it really needs. So I went on your Facebook, Pedro, yeah. and it's just pictures of weed. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I could fucking scroll back for weeks and all that I'd see is pictures of weed. Like your friends would be like, what's Pedro been up to this week? Well, I've looked and I can tell you, he's taking pictures of his weed. <laughs> <laughs> I've never known anyone to be that fucking keen and letting people know that they need to smoke green, but it did draw attention to your complete, complete predictability and the standard instabilities that come with like performing masculinity. I get it. White boys want to front like they're from correctional facilities. <laughs> Hold it down! <laughs> Yo, everyone, please let her keep going, man. Chill. I get it. White boys want to front like they from correctional facilities and document what they think are like roadman activities, like <laughs> like smoking weed because it's illegal. You see? <laughs> yeah, but your purple haze made me cringe for days, especially the way all your fucking statuses say, "Yo, what's good? It's Pedro who wants to blaze." Well, <laughs> Pedro, I'm sorry, babe, but um, I think I'm gonna pass. But in talking of predictability, shall I just summarise your bars? You're gonna insinuate that I'm gay as if that's insulting in some way. You're gonna try and make me hate parts of my body or my face, you're gonna say retarded shit like lose weight, get laid, but then be pissed off later if I try and chirps on your mates. <laughs> is it for you to call me a dyke when the chick I fucked last night didn't really seem to mind? Yeah. I mean, we rang up your chick to see if she was... We rang up your 
double checked to see if she was that way inclined and she just fancied to try, you know, some kush, some wine, and she fucking did. So me and my bitch blew her mind and she was fully like, fuck, is this what I've been missing all this time? <laughs> to my hetero life, leave that boy behind and embrace being a dyke. Dyke, you know? Yeah, man, you're fucking right. Trust me when I say your girl's pussy tastes right. She went to you for the warm-up, but still got to me dry. Jumped on it real quick, let me hit it twice. Whispered real sweet in my ear how there was no tongue like mine and how she wanted to be a dyke, because it keeps her satisfied. <laughs> she said, she said that you, she said that you fucking come the moment you get to grind. Tell me, Pedro. Oh, shut up! She said that you fucking come the moment you get to grind. Tell me, Pedro, is that right? <laughs> Your pussy's more wetter than a water slide. I leave you mortified. This is scary spice and sporty spice. <laughs> Break your forearm. You two look like failed porn stars. Ay <laughs> oh, yo yo yo! I am accelerating. They get rough for the leather bracelets. They're porn stars that never made it. <laughs> yo, I'm like leather faces. You should have a leather face because I fucking rub your bread as bracelets. Ay like oh, yo yo! You look like Tenju. Ay <laughs> oh, yo yo yo! <laughs> Put the shit on red tube. <laughs> oh, yo, hold up. I'll fuck you inside of the restroom. Yo, white and then red blue. That's the, that's the side of your arm. Yo, put a fucking knife in the side of your heart. The size of my heart is big. You got the heart of a bitch. I'm scarring your lips. You have Marmite on the side of your cheek. <laughs> Yeah? You two have the shittest earrings I've ever seen. Oh, uh, yo, yo. Yo, listen. I would never be near them. You never be near men. I come around and I say, I'm gonna be near them. I'm gonna, gonna say, I'm gonna never be near them. Hit them in the head and then the chest will be beer blend. Yo, beer blend will spit out. I leave you run for six ounces in your kids' houses. What are they gonna say when I spit out shit? You can't even face me. I fucking take, give you a razor blade facelift at eight o'clock in the day. <laughs> <laughs> Please, go away. I will fuck you and your mate on my way home today. <laughs> oh, we can have a threesome. You look like a crack fiend. You look like Avril Lavigne if she was actually fiending. <laughs> that's nice. Yo, that's nice. that's nice. Yo, you don't rap right. You should learn to rap right before you get slapped twice, you slag dyke. <laughs> that's time. Let's go. Best ever. Best ever. You look like Tenchu. <laughs> Hold it down, everybody, please. Let her go. She's got two more rounds. Go on, let's, go. let's go. Let's go. Let's go, man. Hold it down, everyone, please. Pedro, mate. Mm. <laughs> Are you all right? <laughs> Does he always do this? <laughs> yeah? You having a good time? <laughs> You seem to have developed a hatred of women that's disturbing me deep set in your mind. But this is kind of a dream battle for me. You look like all my exes combined into one, into one more compressed, yes, poorly dressed mastermind. And I just know if I take even just a little look inside, I'm going to find a lot more weak lines about how all girls are bitches. Am I right? <laughs> just, just line after line that will reveal in time that you still cry over your ex at night. But that's okay, Pedro. So do lots of guys. <laughs> You, Pedro. It's just a problem for you, Pedro, because you're just so fucking nice. So this hard man shit you're trying to do, it's just not gonna fly. <laughs> you should get yourself back out there, mate. One of these girls must like what you bring, man, and I don't mind to help you out, mate. I'll let you be my wingman. Wing man. <laughs> Quite a lot of time on his hands, time he could have used to write some bars, but you didn't, and I understand. <laughs> or do I? Is it because I'm a girl? Is that really what this is? Are you surprised that women can also make these noises? Is it that you don't, <laughs> is it that you don't like seeing women become successful? Tell me, Pedro, do you find that stressful? <laughs> see, see, I'm not gonna lie and chat shit about DMs of fucking dick pigs. 
But I got a couple pics of your chick that were pretty fucking sick. <laughs> and later, yeah, when she be touching clear over this video clip, you can guarantee it's over me and not over this little bitch. Now when she asks you for my number, Pedro, just give her it. <laughs> Cause I got this power, Pedro. I can make a straight chick hate dick. All I do is give them clues on how fucking sweet the taste is. And what's amazing is I don't even have to get them wasted. They just come with me, voluntary. Honestly, it's amazing. But like I said, Pedro, I don't mind to give you some basic training. <laughs> A tip for you, Pedro. A tip for you, Pedro. Why don't you leave the links alone? You're a big boy now. You could give Cologne a fucking go. <laughs> because, because you smell potently like underage kids smoking weed, and I don't know. If it's you smell like a preteen G. Tip number two, maybe take the time to like analyze what you do. Just jam at your mum's making tracks that sound like other people's tunes. <laughs> While your girl's in the next room deciding which member is, of crew she wants to screw. Do you really see this as a career path for you? <laughs> but maybe, if you're lucky, uh, could give you a job as like the don't flop receptionist. Would you like that, Pedro? Yeah? I can lend you some nice dresses. <laughs> time. Listen, hey yo, you look like Yellow Wolf. <laughs> she looks like Yellow Wolf. Hey yo, yo, you got hair like Surgeon General. <laughs> hey yo, yo, this person said that all of that shit. Right, right, you said you wasn't. I don't know what, I can't even remember what you said. Dismembering her head. Left her for dead on her deathbed before I hit the resting with her. Shell. All right, oh, hold up, hold up, hold up a minute. Yo, you're holding your hands. I be bowling your nan. I come about when I'm holding a cam and I film the crime. Yo, you still wanna die? I kill a guy, but you're a girl. I bore you. I send you to another world. Yo, all right. What else is there to say? I can't even remember what you said because everything you said was extra gay. Fuck it. I needed to preparate. Yo. <laughs> Oh, do you know what, yeah? Yo, I leave her deader than DJ Barlow. She, yo, she should have a beard like Marlo. <laughs> Fuck it. You think that you're fit, but you really aren't, though, when you got weird and dark clothes. It's some weird shit. Yo, I said this weird shit. Yo, you fucking get hit in, hit with a hit, weird lip. Oh, yo, hold up, man. Hold up, you got a pierced lip. Yo, you got a pierced nose. You fuck around with weirdos. Yeah. Yo, yo, where'd the rest of your beard go? Big up, big K. Anyway. <laughs> Hold up, hold up. You roll up to roll, don't flop with a roll up and get rubbed with your own pumps. Yo, yo. All right, all right, all right. Who else is up? Right, you look like two butch dykes. Yo, yo, yo. I fucking, I do shush guys. I leave them all dead. Fuck it, forehead, all red. War guys, more feds. Come to the spot, bumping them off. Come round, come with the cost, cutting them off. Cutting the net. Fuck it, I'm dead. Fuck it, you're dead. Fuck it, I'm dead. What is it going to say? Stop your set. Stop your set. Cut with the neck, why do I need to try and say, try and say, fight a girl? You said something about smoking weed, yesterday I beat Tony D, homie please. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Yo, you got a dude's face. Yo, you never move weight, that's why you're still fat. Yo, you got a six pack and you're still fat. Yo, you are a pig. Nah, that's cool. You said you want to get together. We can do this right now. Whenever's blesser. Oh, yo, yo, I'm a heavy dresser. You're a cross dresser. She looks like the black Brock Lesnar. <laughs> Yo, both of them work in a brothel in Rochester. <laughs> Rochester! Yo, it don't matter what your references are. Like the references that you have heavy tits. But you shouldn't have tattooed arms. I heard that you live in a bamboo farm. <laughs> Uh, yo, that was a bit weird, but this chick has got thick ears, you're scratching your head, I'll battery this skit, yes. yo, I'll, I'll, I'll sniff a packet, and then you get slapped in the neck, let's go. yo, let's go, your mum works at Test Morrison's. <laughs> Yeah? Your mum, your mum got raped in Nottingham, and then she come to my yard in Tottenham. <laughs> uh, yo, you will get melted like Frosty the Snowman. You like to hold hands with girls. This is like Manuel versus Vanessa Shagwell. 
I'll punch you here and you'll land in Hanwell. <laughs> you'll get gang banged. You look like a man fam. You are a fucking damn tramp. Mmm. Bang. bang. <laughs> Rochester! How are you going to Rochester, bro? Let's go, bro. I have to apologise, it's fine. Everybody hold it down, it's the last round of the day. Everybody, please quiet down! Yeah, everyone shut up! Everybody shut up, please. She has one more round left and we're done. Thank you very much. Let her go. Yo. Yes, Pedro! Ah! Yeah, me! Another round of slut jokes! I loved it! Get fucked, Pedro! <laughs> to me, to me, you making jokes about me being a slut is as basic as me going, yeah, but he leaves the toilet seat up. Like, it's basic, it's boring, you've done it quite enough. And I do get it, you're jealous, but I just said I'd hook you up. Now, I'm resisting temptations to call you a pussy or a cunt, because I don't think you're good enough to be comparable to one. <laughs> And uh, while I'm here and while I'm feeling a bit pissed, you might think I'm dumb or not aware of this shit and I might be new here, but I'm not new to the politics. Of course I'm completely aware to why you're battling the new chick. You're doing it for the view, so isn't it you that's riding dick? <laughs> We should have a sleepover, Pedro. Me and the girls will give you tips. Because <laughs> I'll, I'll happily tell you the way to best play a player at his game. It's easy to emasculate a total... It's easy to emasculate a total waste of space, especially when all they're actually doing is just bringing ego in your face. It's easy to dismantle that physical state. Yo, Pedro, mate, mm -hmm. get your dick out. <laughs> Let's see what... <laughs> let's see, let's see what all the fucking fuss is about. Let's see if your shit up here matches your shit down south. Let's see the re real reasons why your chick don't let you bust in her mouth. Maybe, <laughs> maybe, and this is just a theory, but maybe it's because no chick wants to suck the dick of the dude who thinks he deserves it, and you don't deserve shit after the standard of your verses. <laughs> because freestyling. <laughs> Yeah, but there's a real craft in writing and because you spit so fucking fast all you do is fuck up all your timings and because you're not writing you've got to stick to real basic rhyming and then expect me to be like, yeah, I found that shit so inspiring, can't wait to see those shots, Pedro will not be firing. Bruv, you made a decision in it to come here freely and get pissed by me, what, because you thought I'd be like, Iggy, well you're the little bitch fam and you look real fucking silly, so spare your chick the embarrassment and just let her leave with me. <laughs> Pedro, I tried but I can't understand your concept. If I was a hip hop head and I'd heard what you said, I'd be real fucking glad that this is a free event. <laughs> and also, while I'm here and while I'm pissed, fuck the bard and fuck all your little fucking mates, the ones who took offence to my political state, because why the fuck did you learn to rap if you don't have anything to say? That's what makes all your bars sound so fucking cliche. See, because I don't like people like you. You want to ride this wave of this thing you didn't create, but you're going you're to bring it nothing new. You should come here to generate, because now we're abusing you. And I'm the one that's using you because I feel like you're only standing there so that I can make my moves. You've been here for years, but you're still a warm-up act. Did you think I was a sack? Did you think? No, shut You've been here for years, but you're still the warm-up act. Did you all think I was a sacrifice? What, did you see my head on that slab? Did you even bother to watch me rap? Don't fucking underestimate me like that. Ooh. Veteran, fan favourite, bruv. You look like a fucking clown because I've been writing for three months. Now tell me, how the fuck does this verse sound when I kill you with this third round? Because your jokes and your bars, they're only going to get you so far when you've got literally no content and your delivery is bizarre. You're just some next little white boy to me. You'd be better off at home with your fucking guitar. You need to have <laughs> Me, you need to, you'd be better off at home with your guitar. You need to analyze what it is that's even got you this far. Mm. Because, <laughs> <laughs> because you're, because Pedro's gimmick is that he shit. <laughs> <laughs> and for some reason, people just clap and reward it. And if I take an L from this and learn that battle rap's not my place, that's fine because I get to wave goodbye in Pedro's fucking face. Uh -huh. <laughs>